Spray alcohol on a mattress. Here's what happens. Rubbing alcohol. Rubbing alcohol has plenty of uses. Most people have some in their first aid kits to clean cuts and some women use it to take off their nail polish when they run out of nail polish remover. There are plenty more uses for rubbing alcohol that you don't know about and some can be life-changing. Cleaning jewelry. Jewelry looks nice and shiny when you buy it, but it can lose its shine over time, especially diamond rings and silver necklaces. If your jewelry looks dull and has lost its luster, you can clean it with rubbing alcohol. Soaking the jewelry in rubbing alcohol for a few minutes will remove the dirt and grime. When you take the jewelry out of the alcohol, clean it off with a cloth and it will look as shiny as it did the day you bought it. Remove fingerprints. Stainless steel appliances make your kitchen look beautiful, but fingerprints appear clearly. If you don't have fingerprint resistant stainless steel appliances, rubbing alcohol can help. You can pour a bit of alcohol on a cloth and wipe down the fridge and the fingerprints will be gone. The next time your kids put their hands all over the appliances, you don't need to panic as long as you have rubbing alcohol in the house. Stretch your shoes. Tight shoes are very uncomfortable. If you have tight shoes, they are likely collecting dust in the back of the closet. If you want to start wearing those shoes again, all you need is rubbing alcohol. Spray a little rubbing alcohol on the inside and outside of the shoes and wear them around the house with a pair of thick socks. The alcohol will help stretch them out and make them more comfortable so that you can wear them and they will be comfortable. Frost If you live on the East Coast, North or the Midwest, you understand how frustrating it can be when you leave the house and your windows are covered in frost. Fortunately, you can get rid of the ice quickly if you have a bottle of rubbing alcohol. You can do this by mixing a half cup of alcohol and a quarter cup of water in a bowl and wash your windows with the mixture using a sponge. You should wash all the windows, especially the back, and it will remove the frost. Also, the alcohol will prevent the windows from frosting as easily the next time it is freezing outside. Fruit flies. Fruit flies are a nuisance because they will fly in your face. Also, they will land on your countertops, fruits and vegetables, which is unsanitary. They are attracted to moisture, which is why you see them more often when your house is hot and humid. If you are tired of fruit flies taking over your kitchen, rubbing alcohol can help. If you spray the alcohol in the area you see the fruit flies, it will kill them and prevent them from returning anytime soon. Cleaning Granite Countertops Granite countertops are gorgeous and expensive, so it is essential to care for them properly. There are plenty of expensive cleaning products that you can use, but rubbing alcohol will do as good a job and it is a lot cheaper. All you have to do is mix the alcohol, water and your favorite essential oil to make it smell nice and wipe down the countertops. This mixture is less abrasive than store-bought cleaning products and it is isn't abrasive. You can even put the solution in a spray bottle to make cleaning easier. Get rid of head lice. If your children have ever had head lice, you know how much trouble it can be. This is especially true if you got head lice from your children. If you have a lice problem, you don't need to spend a fortune on pesticides to kill the ever multiplying critters, and all you need is a bottle of rubbing alcohol. All you need to do is pour the rubbing alcohol on your head. Let it sit for 30 minutes and rinse it out. After the initial treatment, you should dip a comb in alcohol and comb it through your hair. This will kill the lice and it isn't toxic and loaded with pesticides like all lice treatments on the market today. Cleaning your ears Most people use Q-tips to clean their ears, but if the swab is dry, it will remove some of the wax, but most of it will be pushed further down the ear canal. Some people use wax to remove the wax, but this is a hassle, and you can easily clean your ears if you have rubbing alcohol in your house. Simply mix the alcohol with vinegar, wet the Q-tip, and clean your ears. The alcohol and vinegar will dissolve the wax, making it easier to come out. Just be sure you don't push the Q-tip too far into your ear because it will hurt and could rupture your eardrum. Remove stickers. If you've ever had to remove a price tag or a sticker off something, you know how hard it can be. If you don't peel it off intact, you'll be left with part of the sticker and a lot of the glue. Fortunately, you can easily remove the sticker with rubbing alcohol. 
All you need to do is soak a clean cloth in alcohol and hold it over the sticker for several seconds. The alcohol will help dissolve the glue, allowing you to remove the entire sticker and the adhesive with a cloth or your fingernail. Remove the stink from smelly shoes Nobody wants to walk around in stinky shoes because the odor will travel through your socks to your feet. If you have smelly shoes due to sweat, foot odor, or your leather shoes smell after getting wet, rubbing alcohol will save the day. Simply spray the inside of the shoes with rubbing alcohol and let them dry in the sun. The alcohol will soak up the foul smell, eliminating the embarrassing odor. Cleaning your makeup brushes Do you remember the last time you cleaned your makeup brushes? If not, you're probably well overdue. Your makeup brushes touch your face daily and keeping them clean is essential. You don't have to buy expensive makeup cleaners if you have rubbing alcohol in the house. All you need to do is soak the brushes in alcohol for half an hour, wash them with soap and warm water, and let them dry. Your makeup brushes will be clean and you didn't have to spend a fortune to get them that way. Treating Cold Sores Cold sores often pop up at the most inconvenient times, and nobody wants to wake up with a cold sore because it's not very attractive. You don't have to run to the drugstore to buy medication if you have rubbing alcohol. Simply soak a cotton ball in rubbing alcohol and rub it on the cold sore before going to bed. The alcohol will soothe the cold sore and help it diminish quickly. When you wake up in the morning, it'll feel better and it might even be gone. Ticks If you have a dog or a cat, you know how often they get ticks. It's not a good idea to rip off the tick because part of it can remain under the skin, causing irritation or infection. The next time your pet has a tick, put a little bit of rubbing alcohol in the area and it'll loosen the tick's grip. Not only will the alcohol allow you to remove the tick safely, but it'll also disinfect the wound caused by the tick. Clean your eyeglasses You should use a cleaning cloth to clean your glasses daily and clean them often with glasses cleaner. If you don't have any, don't panic. You can clean your glasses if you have rubbing alcohol in the house. All you have to do is mix three quarters of a cup of rubbing alcohol, a quarter cup of water, and a few drops of dish detergent, and you have a homemade eyeglass cleaner. You can put the solution in a spritz bottle and you'll have glasses cleaner whenever you need it, and you can save money at the same time. Homemade Ice Packs When someone in your house gets hurt, they might need an ice pack. Some people buy them in the store or fill a Ziploc bag full of ice to make ice packs, but these options are convenient. Running to the drugstore takes time, and a bag of ice will melt within 20 minutes. If you have rubbing alcohol in the house, you can make your own ice packs that work great. Combine a quarter cup of rubbing alcohol and two-thirds cups of water and pour it into a Ziploc bag. The alcohol will prevent the ice pack from freezing, so you can cover the entire area with the pack and you won't have to worry about it melting. Remove Permanent Marker There's nothing worse than getting permanent marker on your favorite outfit, furniture, or bed sheets because it won't come out in the wash. Fortunately, if you have rubbing alcohol in the house, you can remove the marker stain. Simply pour a little alcohol over the stain and rub it with a clean rag. If you treat the stain immediately, the alcohol should remove the stain. When the stain is gone, wash the clothes or sheets in the washing machine, or wipe down the area of the furniture with warm water and soap. Remove Stains from Your Carpets If you have a stubborn carpet stain that you can't seem to get out, don't panic. As long as you have rubbing alcohol, there's a chance the stain will come out. All you have to do is pour a bit of rubbing alcohol over the stain and use a clean rag to scrub the area gently. If you do this a few times, the stubborn stain will be gone. Sweat Stains Everyone sweats, and it's normal, but it can create sweat stains on your clothes. This is fine at the gym, but if you're going to a job interview, meeting, or any other stressful situation, the last thing you want is sweat stains on your clothes. If you sweat a lot and your deodorant can't keep up, rubbing alcohol can save the day. It's an antiperspirant, and if you rub a bit in areas prone to sweat, like your armpits, you can stop worrying about sweat stains and look your best in any stressful situation. Eliminate Cooking Grease Cooking grease is meant to stay in the pan, but it's not uncommon for it to splash on the stove, backsplash, or the oven's hood. 
can be impossible to remove. It's best to clean the grease as soon as you're done cooking and rubbing alcohol works wonders. Wet a cloth with rubbing alcohol or put it in a spray bottle to clean the grease quickly and easily. Eliminate bed bugs. Bed bugs are a nightmare. They get into your mattress and bite you when you sleep. You can also carry the bed bugs in your clothes to other areas of the house. Bed bugs can be challenging to eliminate, so spray alcohol on a mattress. Here's what happens. Simply spray rubbing alcohol all over your bed. Make sure you get the box spring in the bottom of the mattress and let it air dry. When the bed is dry, use a vacuum to remove any remaining bed bugs. This is a lot cheaper than burning or throwing the mattress away, and your bed will be free of bed bugs. Fix Cracked Makeup Every woman has dropped a compact containing eyeshadow, bronzer, or blush at one point or another, and the makeup cracks. Fortunately, you don't need to spend money replacing the makeup if you have rubbing alcohol in the house. You can spray the makeup with alcohol, and when it's wet, smooth it out with a spoon and let it sit for a few hours. This will harden the makeup and it'll be good as new.